Y'all already know what time it is. It is time for the mess, honey. Mm. What's the business, y'all? This will be your boy, Scott by Nature TV, and we're here for another episode of Yes for the Mess, and we're here to talk about the brat, okay? Now, I thought I was done doing videos for today. I thought I was done doing videos for today. I thought that I was done. I thought it was over with. I thought I could rest a little bit, but bitch, y'all will not let me rest, okay? I done done two videos already today after work, and now I'm on my third, okay? Now, one of my subscribers, okay? Let me call out her name. I'm gonna give her some special treatment today because she gave me this topic to talk about because I had no idea idea that um this was even going on now the 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 subscriber the team scotty member is by the name of miss capricorn so if so if y'all enjoying this video thank miss capricorn for it because she gave me all this tea okay now apparently today on the ricky smiley show gary with the tea was talking about the latest with the situation where portia fallon and simon okay they were talking about fallon doing her interview that's coming up next week which i will be talking about on my channel i don't know if it's going be alive or what but it will be on my channel okay we'll be talking about it <laughs> but yeah um they was doing that and you know gary with the t is messy okay and we already know that he messy because he here with the t you know i'm bringing y'all the t too i wouldn't say that i'm messy i i can be a little bit messy but in a good way in a good 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 way okay so he was giving out the t apparently the brat has some feelings about what was being reported and she even went as far as to go off on fallon okay in defense of portia going in so hard on fallon like it didn't make any sense like she personally cheated on her or what okay now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna play the audio i will put the video on the screen but you know how these copyright claims be going and i ain't got time for it okay so i'm gonna play the audio of the brat going off on fallon and then i'm gonna give y'all my opinion and then i'm gonna let y'all give y'all's down below okay so let's get into this audio i hadn't heard about it <laughs> but anyways <laughs> moving on with y'all another celebrity news y'all baby real housewives of atlanta star miss fallon who bought it is breaking her silence y'all on her um ex-husband to be simon y'all now it's being reported y'all that the star is breaking her silence on her estranged husband simon star. Guardia, huh star <laughs> she's a star oh. um, it's a uh, what she was on real housewife brad star okay she wasn't even one of the main people was she child she ain't had no go, go, go ahead gary oh. go ahead <laughs> My God. Well, anyway, honey, she's breaking her silence, honey, on her um uh, her, her estranged husband, um Simon Gubadia, y'all, and his engagement to Real House of Atlanta co-star Portia Williams. Now they're saying, y'all, in a preview of the interview, now she did an interview with a YouTuber by the name of Adam Newell, and uh, she said that quote Simon doesn't get caught unless Simon wants to be caught. She also went to say that I meant what I said when I took my vows, honey. She said Simon responded on Instagram, y'all, saying this is what he said: the face of cheating wife. Let's start with why I filed for divorce. He said, let's start with who she cheated with and currently pregnant for and living in a home I paid for post-divorce. Oh, and, wow. You know, mm -hmm. His Instagram handle is, honey, um, he, it's, it's Jalen Banks. Oh, he told the guy Instagram um, handle is Jalen Banks. And yes, this is how is. your generosity gets twisted. He said, now let's get started here. And Fallon responded, y'all, with a post about narcissism. How you say the word? Narcissism. Saying at the same time, honey, this is what she said. At the same time, people with narcissistic personality disorder have trouble handling anything they perceive as criticism, and they can become impatient or angry when they stop receiving special treatment. She said, have significant interspinal problems and easily feel slighted, react with rage or contempt, and try to belittle the other person to make themselves appear superior, y'all. Now, she said all that, but honey, this is some mess. And now, I'm, I'm Jalen. So, Brent, see, now, you know who, who Jalen is? I don't know who them people. Word is, on the street. Word is on the street. She cheated and got caught cheating, and then everything else hit the fan. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay. So how about that, Gary? So, so it's 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 two sides to every story. Everybody trying to condemn Portia and all this other stuff, but it's the two sides to every story. And Mr. Simon is not keeping quiet about it. He gonna defend himself too. Oh. Well, 
Fallon don't look like the type of person that would cheat, honey. Baby, like it's her side, one. his side, and then it's the truth. So, wow. we, they, you know, somebody wow. gonna sound good for their side, the other person gonna tell their story, and then you gonna have the truth. But if she cheated on him first, or whatever the case may be, it really ain't none of our business, but that's what seemed to be what happened, okay? So, oh. so fall back on all this. She ain't no star. Let me just say that. Oh. For, for one. Okay. We know her from Housewives. We saw her two times, maybe three. She was running or something with a Medusa hair or something. And, 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 and she showed her swimming pool. And they was in her pool. That's it. That's all you know about her. What else have you seen her on? What else have you seen her on? Oh, boy, I love it. She had a simple white outfit on. Like, come on, man. Don't do this. It, 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 she looks good. It, it, well, that's good. I don't even know the dude she interviewing with. Who is he? Like, come on. Don't do this. Don't do this. She, she, gonna, she gonna get her 15 minutes because this is this is what it is. This she she got to. Oh and, and after this, after this, nothing after else. This, after this, when we gonna see her again? What did she do before that? Come on, man. <laughs> you, what did you, you're an influencer? Everybody an influencer. Come oh, on what? now. She can do what the in the hell Brad had? Brad. Man, I'm, oh, I'm tired of this. I'm tired of everybody talking about this. It's it's two sides to it now. Now yeah. let's stop this, Gary. Now stop being uh, in this mess for you well, be Brad. really up in it and they pull you in it and you be come out windmilling like, I didn't do nothing on this side. <laughs> Let me go to the color. Well, let me go to the color of the day, baby. The color of the day, honey, is fish. Come on, y'all, one time. Now, that was the audio of the brat going off on the Ricky Smiley show on Fallon Gubata about Portia Williams and Simon Gubata. I think I said the name right, okay? Now, here is Scotty by Nature's opinion on this said situation. Yes, I got my hat off. I ain't wanna... I got a new haircut, so why should I keep my hat on? Fuck it. But here's my opinion on this. Why you mad again, brat? Why are you mad? I'm just, I'm just trying to understand why the fuck are you so pissed off about this situation. Now, let's just keep it all the way from 100. Portia is in the news for this shit, for this shit, okay? That's number one. Number two, she's the one who decided to be in this woman's face, be at her house, party with this woman, and then fuck on her husband. That's, that's, num that's number two. Number three, why the fuck you coming so hard on Fallon like that? Like, I get it. Portia is your friend. And all of this stuff, and you want to defend her because she is under fire. A lot of people are dragging her, but then you got some people that's willing to put on their rose-colored glasses and still stand by her regardless of the bullshit that she's doing, okay? But most people are dragging her. So, yes, you feel like you got to sit up and you got to defend her. Totally fine. But don't make yourself look like a fucking hypocrite and don't make yourself look biased. Because let's not forget, when the news came out about Nicole Murphy... And her fucking on somebody else's husband, you was dragging her to death because she fucked your sister's husband. Now let's not, now, 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 now no, no, we're not finna do this. If you're gonna hold one bitch accountable, hold your motherfucking friend accountable. Period. And people in the comments, you don't get friends like the brat. You don't get friends like the brat. She riding for her friend. What she's doing is, is, is just making excuses for her whole ass friend. That's what she's doing. You want to condemn one bitch for fucking on somebody's husband because she fucked your sister's husband. But yet you got a friend fucking on somebody else's husband who was cool with the person that she fucked. Like, are you serious? This girl was cool with her? They, they, never mind the fact if they were best friends or if they were just friends or if they were just associates or hanging out buddies. The fact of the matter is she was hanging out with this girl all at her house, swimming in her pool, eating her food, partying with her and all this other stuff. And then come to find out months later she fucking on her husband. And regardless of anything, if Fallon did cheat on Simon, she's wrong as fuck for cheating on Simon. But still in all, Simon is wrong as fuck for fucking Portia knowing that she was cool with this girl. And Portia knows that she fucking wrong for fucking on Simon knowing she was cool with Fallon. So, at the end of the day, whoever cheated, it's still wrong no matter how the fuck you slice it. If, if Fallon really did cheat, she gotta, we gotta drag her for cheating. But there's no solid proof that she cheated right about now. So, we don't know if she cheated or not. But we know for a fact that Simon cheated on her with Portia. Someone that she was cool with. We know that for a fact, okay? I'm trying to understand why the fuck is the brat so fucking pissed off and so mad about this whole little situation. What the fuck you mad for? Your friend was the one who went out and did some whole shit. It is what it is. So, you talking about you tired of people talking about it. Okay, the more Portia posts this shit on social media, the more she talks about it, the more we gonna talk about it. You can't get mad with us for getting paid for talking about it. She keep putting it out there, we gonna keep talking about it. 
that's just that on that. She made this scandalous. She did that. Get mad at your fucking friend. And you want to get mad at Fallon for speaking up for herself when Simon been going to Instagram speaking on her for months now before she even said anything? Are you fucking kidding me? But, okay, I get it. Portia, your friend. But your friend did some hoe ass shit and you know she did, okay? I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, okay? And the way you went off on Fallon was really a lot, okay? You would think that she fucked on your girlfriend or something, the way you was going in. All I'm gonna say is, you was sitting up here defending your sister when, uh, and all this other stuff and defending, um, what what's her name, Lila Rashawn, when Nicole Murphy fucked on her husband, but your, but your friend and co-worker is sitting up here doing the same shit. And you talk about everybody want to condemn Portia. We condemning Portia because she was doing some foul ass shit. You don't be hanging out with me and then fuck on my man. I choose violence. Are you serious? Like, the brat really, girl, like, mm-mm. But really, that's all I had to say about that. Um, be sure to leave your comments below. Let's talk about it down below. Let's keep it respectful. To, to, to each other and to the person that's entertaining you, okay? Now, make sure you like, rate, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Do whatever you see fit. Be sure to follow me on all my social media. My Twitter and Instagram is at the bottom. If you want to keep in touch with me and send me all the tea, that's where you send it to, okay? Now, with that being said, I believe this is the last video that I'm going to do for today because I know I got to go to Really B's channel in a little while over there. So if you want to catch me later on on live, catch me on Really B's channel, I believe, okay? With that being said, you guys, I'm out of here until next video. I'll holler at you later. Peace out.